My guest is uh, Ms. Wang Ping, who is the chairwoman, chairperson for the Chamber of Tourism, All China Federation. Can you please explain to us what does the Chamber of Tourism, All China Federation do? We help the government to management and uh, to work for the government to control the all the Chinese tourism private company and market. Because you know, in China now the 90% market controlled by the private uh, company. So we do this kind of business for the government. And how does the federation uh, work together with the China National Tourist uh, Office? Tourist uh, agency. You mean China Tourism uh, Authority or Affair? Okay. He asked, "How do we work with the government to communicate with the private sector?" We uh, it's different with the China. In China, we have another uh, China Tourism uh, uh, like committee that uh, belongs to the government. And uh, also, China Tourism Authority, they are, uh, you know, like America, they have a tourism uh, some department, okay? They work in the, they give the uh, law or the regulation in the uh, market, for example. Uh, our chamber is work for the, for the government to connect with a private company to give uh, or collect a lot of uh, in information for the government. And also, we help the government to let them to understand the uh, government's idea and uh, communicate with uh, a broad uh, company. UNWTO, United uh, Nations World Tourism Organization, the member in UNWTO would be CNTA or the Federation? We are not a member for the uh, WTO. We are a uh, uh, partner with WTTC. How many organizations, companies in China are members or participate in the federation? Yeah. Yeah. You know, because the China's land is huge and the uh, population is uh, very huge. And so we are the member for us. We don't let uh, to uh, let the, the private uh, personal member to us. All, all the member is come from separate, like uh, every province is one branch. And then province, they have a city, another branch and branch, okay? So all that we collect this kind of uh, group member is uh, to be our member. You have uh, Beijing, Shanghai, Guangzhou would be direct members of the Tourism All China Federation. Otherwise, it becomes it's different provinces who are the federation of the different provinces are member of the national federation, with each city having the local federation member of the provincial federation. Okay, because uh, the small province or other small city, they belong first. They belong to their branch, their province, uh, the chamber, and then we control that province uh, chamber. It's our branch. What are the main issues, important issues that the federation is now addressing in China? Uh, you you mean our federation? Okay, to now, we and last year, you know, China, the tourism, uh, go abroad for the tourism, uh, is uh, 45 million and increased 10 percent than the last, last year, okay. So this year will be more. So maybe in next 10 years, the, the people who want to uh, visit to outside, more than 100 million people, uh, also in domestic. China tourism in, in mainland in the last year more than 100 uh, million more so this huge uh, or big uh, uh, the people how tourism people and travel people 
is an issue for us how to help the government to management and to manage and to how to help the government to make them more better on a high level and for the people who want to visit China also. Which aspect of cultural and heritage uh, will be tackled first, will be addressed first? The historical and cultural sites, the natural sites, all of the above? You know, uh, this uh, topic is huge. Uh, it's a big uh, topic. Okay, so for our uh, federation, we uh, we we uh, our uh, we, we should do our best. Okay, for example, uh, in the August this year, we will send more than uh, 70 uh, officer, but it's a lower level tourism officer uh, from uh, West, not undeveloped uh, province. Okay, and send them to Hong Kong. It's a free. We help them to learn how to protect uh, the, the property or heritage, uh, natural place or something like that, to learn two months, uh, two weeks. And we educate them to let the local government to know how to do that. This is our first thing we want to do now. Uh, this is the first year we send this kind of uh, uh, officer, local officer, to the Hong Kong to learn. But in our plan, we want to send them uh, during these 10 years to send more than 1,000 people to Hong Kong to learn how to manage and protect uh, the local heritage things. Okay. This uh, uh, help from the Hong Kong, we call the Pei Hua Tourism Foundation. They pay for this kind of people to visit and edu educate in Hong Kong. No matter the people, uh, how to do in the uh, when when he's travel or he visits somewhere, the local officer must be understand how to do that, and then more easier for us to let them understand. What does she think the biggest challenge or opportunity that the travel and tourism industry faces mm -hmm. for the next two years uh, in China or in globally? Okay. 他说呢，您肯定也做很多国际上的这些旅游啊，而且去。Now every people think the whole global tourism is a nice and new industrial, commercial or some the nice business, okay? But uh, we should have, must pay uh, uh, attention about you know now the the the, the food rise and the oil rise raise up very quickly. So if uh, the, the, the the price raise up very very high, so must make some. Uh, uh, place uh, local people very poor so when the, a lot of pe poor people is uh, uh, increase up okay and then the the peace can maybe uh, cannot exist so if uh, the peace is you, you cannot uh, uh, and, and every tourism uh, don't want to go the place without peace okay. uh, uh, yes, uh, she wants to have a speech, but uh, the time is out, okay. She wants to mention to everybody, now that China developed in these 20 years very fast, okay, but a uh, lot of uh, other for, uh, Western country, maybe they don't like China uh, developed well. So, but he, he uh, she gets, if, uh, for example, we back to the 20 years before, or China like a poor, or uh, let uh, a lot of Chinese people no rice, no food to eat, more dangerous than now. So he's uh, also uh, like uh, we back to the topic of the tourism. Just f for the undeveloped area, just if we develop uh, tourism at that place, is uh, very good and very direct benefit for that local people to let them uh, uh, the, the, the become uh, become better. And we think, you know, must let the Chinese uh, uh, 1.3 billion uh, people to, to have the clothes, have the food, and then the world is more peace, as just now said. And now we want to, to uh, let all the other people, other countries' people visit to China. We like tourism or travel to China. 
and then we let the Chinese people go out. We understand each other more, so they know the China situation. We use the tourist uh, travels this kind of business to let uh, uh, both uh, sides' uh, idea to mix them together to under each other is more uh, useful for the whole world.